Have you ever stumbled upon a TV show that made you laugh, gasp, and maybe even cry a little? There's this old series from back in 1973 called Police Story that does just that. It's all about crime and catching the bad guys, and it really grabs your attention right from the start. But the best part, it's full of surprises. You never know if you'll be laughing one moment, shocked the next, or feeling a bit teary-eyed. Do you have any cool memories about watching this show? Maybe there's a character you really liked. Share your stories with us down below. Keep an eye out for more interesting stuff about Police Story. In 1973, a revolutionary television series premiered, reshaping the way audiences perceive police dramas. Picture a time when TV viewers craved authenticity, a glimpse into the gritty reality of law enforcement. This show not only met, but exceeded those expectations influencing crime dramas for years to come. Born during a period of significant societal changes, it wasn't just another cop show. It reflected the evolving tastes of viewers and mirrored the challenges of its era. Created by Joseph Wambaugh, a former LAPD detective, it drew from real experiences, breaking away from traditional storytelling to present raw, unfiltered narratives. What set it apart was its commitment to realism and genuine portrayal of police work. With stellar performances from a talented cast, each episode unfolded like a captivating chapter, exploring the complexities of crime and the human condition. Week after week, viewers were given a front row seat to this captivating world, not just entertained but immersed in the lives of those navigating the intricate landscape of crime and justice. The TV crime drama we're talking about here really changed things up back in the day. Its realistic portrayal of cops' lives stood out from the flashy, exaggerated stuff other shows were doing at the time. This style didn't just stay in its own time, though. It influenced future shows to keep it real, too. You had stuff like Hill Street Blues and NYPD Blue taking notes from this show's playbook, digging deep into the gritty side of police work. And it didn't stop there. Some spin-offs came out of this show's success, like Police Woman, Joe Forrester, and David Cassidy Man Undercover. Each of them found their own place in the genre, showing just how big of a deal this show was for TV crime dramas. That influence has stuck around, shaping how we see cop shows even now. It's like the roots of today's crime TV were planted by this show. Pretty neat, right? Crafted from the real-life experiences of LAPD police officer Edward Taylor, the TV series explores the gritty world of the Los Angeles Police Department. Syndicated in two one-hour segments, several two-hour episodes, including all season five segments, along with the television movies A Cry for Justice and Confessions of a Lady Cop, have found their way to viewers. One noteworthy episode, a community of victims, courageously delved into the sensitive issue of rape, garnering both praise for its thoughtful handling and criticism for its explicit content the installment stands out for its impactful portrayal of a challenging societal concern. Navigating the harsh realities of law enforcement, the series remains rooted in the authentic experiences of an LAPD officer, offering viewers a raw and unfiltered glimpse into the challenges and controversies of policing. Incident in the Killing Zone featured Jan Michael Vincent, Alex Gord, and James Farentino, who later co-starred in action shows with high-tech helicopters, namely Airwolf and Blue Thunder. Notably, Joe Santos from another episode appeared in the movie Blue Thunder. Due to its intense and occasionally graphic content, Police Story faced viewer complaints about its suitability for family viewing. Despite this, the show showcased many future big stars in guest roles, including Kurt Russell, Tom Selleck, and David Cassidy. The show's roster of guest actors added to its appeal, featuring names who would later become significant in the industry. This included Joe Santos from Police Story, later seen in Blue Thunder, alongside other rising stars like Kurt Russell, Tom Selleck, and David Cassidy. The show's occasional controversy over its suitability for family viewing didn't deter its ability to serve as a platform for emerging talents. In 1991, James Farentino faced legal trouble while filming Miles from Nowhere in Vancouver, Canada. The Royal Canadian Mounted Police intercepted a package containing 3-2 grams of cocaine addressed to his hotel room. Charged with cocaine possession, Farentino was released on bail during the production hiatus. Scott Brady, known for occasional stage appearances, made his Broadway debut in the 1959 musical Destry Rides Again. This production, based on the classic James Stewart Marlene Dietrich film, featured Andy Griffith and Dolores Gray, with Brady taking on the villainous role originally played by Brian Donlevy. Ron Massack holds a unique distinction as the sole military policeman to participate in the world touring all army show. This distinctive aspect of his career sets him apart in the world of performers. 
These behind the scenes anecdotes shed light on the diverse experiences of the individuals associated with the series, showcasing a range of challenges and accomplishments within the realm of entertainment. Did you know that a famous TV show had an unexpected impact on real life events? In an interview, a well-known criminal revealed that he learned some tricks from the show about avoiding the police. It seems like this show unintentionally became a guide for criminals on how to escape law enforcement. In one episode called War Games, an actor who later became famous for playing a detective found himself involved in a bank robbery. This episode happened before he got his big role as a detective in another show. Another episode called The Gamble featured a young actor who later became a big movie star. It's interesting to see these early roles of famous actors before they became really popular. So, this TV show didn't just entertain people, it also influenced some unexpected things in real life, from criminals learning tricks to actors getting their start. It's pretty surprising how far its impact reached. Several episodes of the series delved into controversial and socially relevant issues, including police corruption, racial tensions, and the aftermath of the Vietnam War on returning veterans. In one episode, the Malflores Eric Estrada portrayed a Latino police officer, foreshadowing his breakout role on Chips. The show's opening theme, composed by Jerry Goldsmith, remains one of the most iconic in the crime drama genre. Inspired by the Jolson story at a young age, Ron Massack developed a talent for impersonating Al Jolson. His skills even diffused a potential schoolyard brawl once. Jan Michael Vinson and Robert Englund shared the screen in Buster and Billy and Big Wednesday. The series garnered critical acclaim, clinching multiple primetime Emmy awards for outstanding drama series and outstanding directing for a drama series. In a tragic turn of events, one of the episodes in 1973's television series Police Story saw a devastating loss. The storyline featured a seasoned detective who, in the line of duty, met an untimely demise. The unexpected twist left viewers stunned, showcasing the harsh realities faced by law enforcement officers in their daily lives. The episode's poignant portrayal of loss and its impact on those left behind resonated deeply with audiences, highlighting the sacrifices made by officers in service to their communities. Despite the fictional nature of the series, the emotional depth of this particular episode left a lasting impression on viewers, serving as a reminder of the dangers faced by those who protect and serve. In the world of television, there's a series that stood out for its raw portrayal of police work in Los Angeles. Set in the 70s, it depicted the daily struggles and triumphs of officers dealing with crime in the city. During filming, tragedy struck when a cast member suffered a fatal heart attack on set, casting a shadow over the production. Created by a former LAPD detective, the show aimed to give viewers a glimpse into the real challenges faced by law enforcers. Each episode tackled different aspects of police work, from drug busts to homicide investigations, offering a gritty yet authentic portrayal. The ensemble cast, including actors like Scott Brady and Don Meredith, brought depth to their characters, making the show feel genuine. Despite facing hurdles like budget constraints and scheduling issues, the team behind the series worked tirelessly to deliver compelling episodes. Despite its challenges, the show left a mark on television history, influencing countless crime dramas that followed. Its legacy lies on a testament to the groundbreaking work of those involved, 